Hey guys, my name is Jimmy. Thanks for watching Lethal Gaming. This video, I'm going to be showing off the new remote play uh, with the PC and or Mac. So first, you're going, to, you're going to want to install the app to your computer, and I'll provide a link in the description on where to find that that app. Uh, install it, update it, and then you're going to want to plug your controller here into your laptop with a USB cable. Start the app. It will connect uh, through the through the internet you can do it manually or through the through the wireless connection I chose wireless connection it took a couple minutes it took three or four minutes for it to finally connect and then this is the screen screen I'm at now so I'm gonna play a little bit of um, Mortal Kombat I want to basically play something that has 60 frames per second and uh, test out the latency and whatnot uh, so far on the main screen Everything. And I'm on Wi-Fi right now. I'm not directly plugged in uh, with the Ethernet cable. Uh, so far, uh, it, it seems pretty, pretty quick, uh, almost as if there's no delay whatsoever. Uh, I can tell immediately that there is a lack in um, resolution. I believe this is maxed out at 720p, as opposed to the um, 1080p uh, standard. So let's. Well, first, let's check out the store. Let's see. Let's see if um, I can see any, tell any differences with speed here. All right, let's just jump into the game. I mean, so far, everything seems pretty pretty quick and now I know with my Vita uh, I get a lot of um, oh how can I explain it it's almost like it's not a perfect connection with my Vita uh, I can definitely see a different a latency issue um, quite often really uh, sometimes I can get a good hour in without any problems but for the most part I do get that judder and slow down every once in a while from the Vita and I want to see if I get that with the laptop here. Okay. I'm sure the video quality is probably not going to be too good here. Single fight. Oh, we'll fight some. So far, I it, it, it seems pretty spot on right now, and I'm just staring at the computer screen right now. Trying to see if I feel any issues here, and so far, I mean, it's it feels good. Like my combos, when I can actually pull them off, I feel like they're. Yeah, I'm pretty. Uh, I'm pretty happy with this. 
Um, it's going to be nice to be able to watch some TV and, and just use my laptop here and uh, play the PS4 on a larger screen, so that's nice. Um, I mean, the video quality is 720p, but it, you know, it doesn't look that bad. Um, just tested a couple other things here with the remote. I think if you shake the mouse, you can pull up. Yeah, you can pull up some more features down here, which is your your battery life, uh, which I, it should be charging since we're plugged directly in with the USB cable. Share button, middle button, power uh, PlayStation button, options button. Um, your screen size, so you can move it around actually like that. And hey, the the we can even we can even make it look like a Vita. I guess the Vita is more like that, huh? There you go. But, yeah, I, I think this works really well. You know, the Xbox One um, streaming works quite well, too. So I was really wanting to compare, uh, you know, how well this worked compared to the, to the uh, Windows 10 streaming abilities. And this seems to be do pretty well. Now, I wish uh, the Xbox allows you to uh, record uh, straight to your laptop and you can record um, I think two hours or maybe more two three hours something like that and I, I think it would be really cool if, if Sony allowed me to record from my laptop so I can get more than 20 minutes that would be you know that would be great hopefully they can do something like that but I know this is more of a remote play my computer's not really doing anything where I think the Windows 10 app might be it's streaming to the actual laptop, I think, which is allowing me to to record footage and take pictures and, and directly from the laptop. So, I don't know. Uh, we'll see what happens. But anyway, hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, thanks for watching.